another interesting video on data cleansing and exploration. Data scientists spent 60 to 70 percent of their time in cleaning and organizing their data. This shiny app will help you minimizing the time spent on this process. Here we cover most of the steps involved in data cleansing and exploration. Starting from basic operation like renaming columns, deleting unwanted columns, changing data types, handling uh, NAs and missing values. You have options to create dummy variables, convert the table into long format, normalization, data grouping, data visualization, as correlation plot, box plot, linearity test and summary statistics. Let's start the demo. I have a dummy data set, browse, data set, open, now get the data. Now let us see the structure and type of the columns. You could see that NAs as well. The duration has got 26 NAs. Let us see the show table. ID probably we may not need, we may have to delete it. Age, we could group it. It looks like report date is a character, we may have, we could convert it into proper date format. Marital status, we could even create a dummy variable. Some of the algorithms may require dummy variables. Now, duration has got missing values. Let us clean up now. ID we may not require for some of our analysis. Delete, select and delete. Now report date. Report date has got a dot. Let me rename that column. Probably I will add an underscore. Okay. Similarly other columns whatever required you could modify. Commit. It has been done. Now, come to the cleaning again. Report date is a character. I would like to convert it as a date. Yes, done. Now you could see the date format has changed. Now age. Let us go do some grouping. When you group it by five, before grouping you have 42 unique ages. Now after grouping you get nine nine groups commit grouping has been updated now let us take the marital status marital status create dummies yes see marital status you can see the show table marital status year is is totally blank you could delete that column year delete column. Now, now comes that duration. Let us see the histogram. Duration. Histogram. Now, <coughs> depending on your uh, data set, you could decide uh, replacing NAS with uh, mean, median or mode. I, I have decided to replace it with mean duration click mean yes yes done now you could see the duration has been the missing values have been updated with the mean value okay now when you do certain analysis let us go to the data table when you do certain analysis see here balance has got four digit Duration has got two and four digits. Probably you may need uh, normalization or standardization. Just click. Yes, normalization is done. Data has been normalized. Okay, now let me load another data set for to review the other functionalities. Irish data set. Get data. Now X 
I think this is an ID. Yes, we may not require. Delete it. Now, this is a long format. I would like to convert it into, sorry, it's a void format. I would like to convert it into long format. Select the key, void to long. Done. See, now the entire data set has become long format. I would like to save it as a CSV. Yes, you could save it. Similarly, you could save it as an RDS file as well. If I want to see the structure, yes, you can see here the structure. Now, let us load empty cars data set. Yes. Let me go to the, let us remove that same ID, Excel. Okay. You have box plot. You get histogram. QQ plot. Density plot. Linear test. Linear test requires a target variable to be identified. Let us identify the target variable. Empty cars, miles per gallon is the target variable. Select that, fix it as a target variable. Now you go to that multiple chart. Select the linear test. Linear test. Cylinder versus miles per gallon. Yes, as the cylinder increase, miles per gallon comes down. Similarly, the all types of residual plot, normal QQ plot, you could see it here. Now let us review the correlation plot. If the plot is congested with more variables, you could remove some of them. Let us keep the miles per gallon and see the correlation with, among these variables. Other functionalities like summary statistics, descriptive statistics, you could see here, all the statistics are there. Then I would like to remove some of the out layers, okay, you could go here. miles per gallon. Here actually it is, there is no out layers. Yes, see, there is an out layer, single out layer. I would like to replace that out layer with, see, it got replaced. So, you have an option to replace the out layers with first quartile, second quartile, third and fourth quartile. Now at the end, as I told you, you could save it as a data set. There is a link in the description for you to download the R script. R script carries suitable heading, well organized and easy to follow. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Your feedback on this video will help me a lot. Please leave your comments to see more videos on this subject. Consider subscribing. Thank you once again.